The TrueFire 3 desktop app is an installed program for Windows and Mac computers. This program gives you full access to all of your purchased TrueFire courses and allows you to download the content to your computer for full offline access. Once you have installed the TrueFire 3 desktop app to your computer, simply log in with your TrueFire username and password. Now this program is fully responsive, so you can completely adjust the screen to fit whatever matches your needs. When you first log in, you will get access to all of your purchased TrueFire courses. To work with a course, simply select it, and it will load up all of the video lessons. As you can see, this course is not yet fully downloaded to my computer. You can download the course one of two ways. Simply by clicking on a lesson, it'll start the download process for that video and all of the assets. Alternatively, you can click the download all icon to download the full course to your computer. Now this player does come with a lot of the player controls that you are used to seeing. So you can play or pause the video, fast forward and rewind. We have a master volume control, auto loop, which will allow you to play the next video on the list automatically. We have looping tools, which let's select. You go ahead and start a loop of the video, and then when you're ready, click the end loop, and then the infinity tool will replay that section repeatedly until you are done looping. We also have a slow motion feature, which allows you to slow down or speed up the video, and additional tools such as like a metronome and a timer. The PDF chart will appear underneath the video screen when available. You can also open up this PDF outside of the player using the PDF icon, or you can get access to the guitar profiles. Jam tracks when available will be accessed at the very bottom of the screen. Again, you can play, pause, rewind, fast forward, change the volume controls, loop and slow down the jam tracks. Our desktop app also includes sound slice technology when it is available with this course. Lessons that come with sound slice have the sound slice icon available. Sound slice allows you to see the standard notation and tablature underneath or along with the, oops, let me click up here, with the video as it is being played. Here we can give you an example of that. With the Sound Slice technology, you can still do things such as loop sections of the video by clicking different video parts of the tab and notation. You can also change the speed of the video and have additional options as well. Again, this player is fully responsive, so you are able to adjust various things, such as the size of the video lessons. You can hide or expand this view. We also have a side-by-side -side view, which allows you to see the video side-by-side. -side. You can also toggle back to your classic view. if you prefer just the PDF versus the sound slice. We have additional tools aside each video lesson, which allows you to favorite a specific video lesson. You can track your progress, which means you can select that video as in progress, complete or incomplete. And the icon here on this far right just allows you to know if that video has been downloaded yet or not. Finally, you can mark your full course as a favorite course, and I'll show you where you can view that in just a moment. Go back to full screen. Sorry. All right. Up at the top, the first icon here, that's back to your My Courses, which allows you to see the courses you have purchased. You can search your courses by typing in specific keywords. You can adjust the sort by to organize the page. Um, you can also go to a list view 
which allows you to view the same courses just in a table view. Any of these sections at the top can be selected to organize based on that option. On this page, you can also see we do have a download all icon to download the course fully to your computer, a folder icon, which is going to show you all the raw files for that course, the MP4s, MP3s, PDFs, and so forth, or finally you can delete those files from your computer. At the very bottom of the screen is going to be the storage path to where those files are living on your computer. You can choose to leave it at this default location or click the change button to move to an external drive um, or an alternate location on your computer. The other features we have in this desktop app is an explore and this will just allow you to view other courses which you may or may not own. Anything marked with my course is something you own. If it's not a purchase course, when you click to learn more about it, it will take you out to the website to learn more. We also have a My Favorite section where you can view courses you've marked as favorites or individual lessons that you've marked as a favorite. We have an inbox that just tells you more detailed information um, from us to you guys about what's going on in the world of Truefire. Finally, if you go to your username at the top right and click on options, you can set or check a couple of the settings details for your desktop app. Things you can change is the interface color. You can do a light view or a dark view. Change the color which goes behind the video screen to white or black. You can set the default view, whether you choose a normal view, again what we consider the video on the top and the lesson materials or sound slides underneath the video, or a side-by-side -side view. And you can choose the default video player to enable sound slice when it is available, or the classic view. Now again, under options here, we do have a button to go offline. When offline, that is only gonna show you the content which you have downloaded to your computer. Now you do not need to click this go offline to work offline with your player. Any course that has already been downloaded to your computer, as soon as you start to play one of those video lessons, it's going to pull from the files that are living on your computer and not be streaming from the internet. Likewise, if you just choose to open up your program with no internet connection, it will automatically go into offline mode for you to give you full access to all of your downloaded content. We hope you enjoy the TrueFire 3 desktop app. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to let us know, truefire.com.